What is up guys, it is spring break and so what I have here is Onyx Coffee Lab. Um, just look at the label, it's so, you can see that it is purely bougie, this is like super bougie coffee and it's got like a whole list of making it, pretty fancy stuff. Probably wouldn't buy this on the daily, but you know what? What the plan is, is take this coffee and make it in a normal fashion. Usually this coffee is made in a super special way, but you know what? We're not even gonna use a hand grinder. We're gonna use our electric grinder. We're gonna make it in a regular coffee pot. I actually emailed these guys, and I was like, hey, would this stuff be good in a regular coffee pot? This is like, yeah, just put in your coffee pot and use good water and you should be good. <laughs> Let's uh, test this bad boy out. Grind right before brewing, choose your brew method, put on your favorite record. I've got Xavier Rudd playing right now, and then extract and drink. Let's see how this goes. It's time para la cafe, see? So, notes, the stuff that you're supposed to be tasting. Apple, dates, honey, tangerine and white tea. As you can see, it is called Peru Maria Rojas. Rojas, Rojas. Okay, let's see if it tastes good. Hace calor, si. Whoa! It actually tastes fruity. <laughs> Whoa! It spilled a little bit. It, it actually tastes fruity. Like, thought I was just gonna taste like another cup of gel. I, I made it in my coffee maker, regular coffee maker. Actually tastes like fruit, that's crazy. I was completely, I was completely skeptical. That tastes legitimately like fruit. I guess it's better if it costs 17 bucks for 10 ounces of beans. It better taste like what you say tastes like. Mm. I want to see some quarter. Mmm, that's good. If I had to give it a rating, four and a half out of five stars, wouldn't give it five stars purely because I think I messed it up a little bit. I think I could have made it a little bit stronger. It's a good cup of coffee. By the way, guys, if you haven't checked out Onyx Coffee Labs, they're super cool. I even got a t-shirt from them, but I don't know where it is, so I'm not gonna grab it. But make sure to check them out, based out of Arkansas. Um, they have some really cool stuff on their website. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Love you guys, bye.